Okay, two water pumps working together took exactly four hours to fill a pool. So together, it's four hours. If the constant rate of one pump was 1.5 times the constant rate of the other, so now we're not in a time column, we're in a rate column. So that would be X, and the other one goes 1.5 times X, 1.5 times X, so he's faster, I guess, his rate. And to represent time as a rate, this guy is four hours, but if you wanna represent that as a rate, you take the reciprocal. So four over one uh, would be one fourth is the reciprocal. So let's add our rates together to get our to get to get our total. So rate one, first pump is x, and he's working with pump two, which is 1.5x, equals one fourth. Now, I'm gonna switch this to three halves because I like fractions better, but if you don't, change everything to decimals. So this is one X or two over two X. So that gives me five halves X equal one fourth. And let's cross multiply. And that gives me five X times four is 20 X equals two times one, which is two. So that's x equal 2 over 20, or 1 tenth. So this is 1 tenth. Now what am I trying to find? I'm trying to find uh, how many hours would it have taken the faster pump to fill the pool if he had worked alone at his constant rate? How many hours? So we're trying to find this guy's number of hours, okay? So what do I have? I know his rate is 3 halves x. So 3 halves times x, remember 1.5 is 3 over 2, times x, which we just found to be 10. So that's 3 over 20. So his rate is 3 over 20. But if you want to convert that back to time, meaning the number of hours, you take the reciprocal of that, which is 20 over 3. Is that one of my choices? Yes, it's the last one.